Facts First presents 10-Year-Old Boy Invents a Device to Stop Children from Dying in Hot Cars Since His Neighbor Died Before we get into the video, do us a favor and click that like button, and also click the subscribe button and notification bell so you don't miss any of our future videos. When the weather heats up during the summer, young children are at risk. According to recent statistics, over 712 children have died of heat stroke since 1998 in the United States alone. When parents leave their children in the car for even short periods of time, that car can heat up to dangerous temperatures, causing illness, even death. It's a sad reality, but we see things like this almost on a weekly basis. A 10-year-old boy invents a genius device to stop children dying in hot cars after his neighbor's death. Bishop Curry from McKinney, Texas was devastated when he found out that his infant neighbor had died. The fifth-grade boy saw his neighbor's family torn apart when their six-month-old baby died in the car due to the extreme temperatures. The young boy wondered why cars don't come equipped with devices to keep that from happening. He thought that if car manufacturers did have a device in the car to keep the temperatures down, that those 712 children who had died would still be here today. That's when he came up with an amazing idea he wanted to invent a device that would emit cool air once the temperature in the car reached a certain level. He thought that it would also be a good idea if it could alert parents, the authorities, and people around the car when it became too hot. He wanted to call the device the Oasis. His idea wasn't just a dream that he hoped he could create when he grew up. Nope. This 10-year-old boy wanted to show people that he was serious, and he created a 3D clay model of the device. His family knew he was serious, too, about creating the invention, so they stepped in to help. Bishop came from a working-class family, so his parents didn't have extra cash lying around to fund such a project. Bishop would need to manufacture the device, and he would also need to get a patent for it on his own. Since the family didn't have the startup cash, Bishop's father helped him set up the GoFundMe page to raise money necessary to make the device and get it out to the public. Mr. Curry created the page and then shared the link on Facebook and Twitter. People started sharing the GoFundMe page link and the donations started pouring in. He also did an interview on the local evening news. And this raised even more awareness and the donations began pouring in again. Since the GoFundMe page was created, Bishop raised over $24,000. They had an initial goal of $20,000, so they were thrilled when the donations surpassed what they asked for. It wasn't long before the boy and his family raised $50,292 to get their project off the ground more than twice what they were asking for. In the 18 months that the GoFundMe page was active, 1,596 people donated money. Thanks to the generosity of others, Bishop earned enough money to get his patent for the Oasis. Bishop was thrilled that he had the money for the patent, but he knew the work wasn't done. They were also going to need help to manufacture the product. When the GoFundMe page more than doubled their goal, they shut it down. They started accepting donations for the next phase of the project at Manufacturing Oasis. When word got out about Bishop's idea, it caught the attention of a Silicon Valley-based company called Patents to Market. The company works with inventors and manufacturers who have great ideas. They're working with Bishop now and his father to make his dream a reality, but his father shared this update on Facebook. It quickly went viral. In only a few hours, his post was shared over 8,000 times. The reason so many people donated money and helped to spread the word about the Oasis is because if it's created, it could save the lives of thousands of children and also protect the health of millions of children. Bishop says his invention can do more than just save innocent kids, though. It can also save pets. When an owner leaves their pet in the car on a hot day while they shop, it can be life-threatening for the animal just like it would be for a child. Bishop says he's not doing this for the money or the notoriety that comes with inventing something. He did it to keep families from ever having to go through what he saw his neighbor's family go through. When he thinks about his invention, his only dream is to never hear about a child or an animal dying in a hot car ever again. Now that Bishop has a backer, it's only a matter of time before you see the Oasis on store shelves. And it couldn't come soon enough. Subscribe for more!